Welcome back to the channel and today I'm going to be doing more crafting but it's not making a new pen I'm going to make a new wallet so I've uh, been doing some research on the internet and I found a design which I have uh, printed and I've adapted slightly to make the design work for what I want and here's my design for the bits I'm going to be doing and cutting out so I'm going to I've stuck, cut them out already obviously then stuck them onto a bit of card and these are going to form the templates for be using a leather. So that's the templates I'm going to use for my design. And I also ordered this superb beginner's kit for leather working, which has got all the tools and accoutrement that you're going to need for doing basic to intermediate level uh, leather work. So, so that's the templates cut out. Here we are, I've cut the piece leather off that I just need to concentrate on. But what I would advise, which I forgot to mention earlier, obviously this cutter is very, very sharp. And obviously you're dealing with sharp implements. So just be careful what you're doing. Always maximize what you're doing. I'm wearing glasses so I can see what I'm doing, but obviously keep your fingers well away from any cutting edges to make sure you don't slice your fingers. I've burnished the edges of this leather here. Um, and I'm just gonna do this one here using this and a bit of the um, bit of the oil. So the way this wallet's gonna to go together is this is gonna be uh, sewn together like this. And this will wrap around, bear with me while I'm doing this off camera. Will wrap around like so. So what I'm gonna do now is use the dividers to mark about four or five mil in from the edge of the areas where I'm going to be sewing so that I can then make sure I put the holes in the correct distance away from the edge all the way around where I'm going to sew. So what I've done now is I have stuck the uh, size together on this for the time being. I'm got to rub that down with a bit of sandpaper, which I've got will do in a minute. But I've also punched the holes through where this will wrap around and meet up. So I'm just going to rub this side down with sandpaper, and then I'll get onto sewing, which I will use my trusty clothes hanger to hold together, so I can stitch it. What I've done here is I've just uh, lined up the holes with, the, with some spare needles just to make sure it, it all goes where I want it to. And you know what? It's looking okay so far. So you can get some idea of what it will look like in the end for the card holder. Here we are after some stitching. I'll tell you what, it's tough going with some needles I've got, obviously for my starter pack. But do you know what? I think the fact that the person who wanted this one wanted a lighter twine, it doesn't show up very well, but it actually looks pretty good. But I'll continue with the rest and see how it goes. So that's finished stitching, I've got to say. My thumb is really aching. But you know what? I'm really, really chuffed with it, actually. For my first ever attempt, I'm just going to do a bit of beautification. And I'll get back to you shortly once I've done that. So I've done a bit more work, I've just done a bit of beautification on it and excuse the dog outside. But uh, yeah, it's looking good so far. I've just got a few minor points, so I've just got to break up this glue in here now so I can fit uh, cards in here because I glued it together initially just so I could uh, punch a hole through it properly. And yeah, I've just got to put some colouring on the edge here just to put it back to a dark colour so you can't see the edges where it's been bevelled. So what I'm using is this leather colour restore that you may have watched me or seen me use on a previous video when I renovated our sofas. 
I'm using exactly the same thing to put around the edges of the wallet. I let it stay on for five minutes. I'm going to buff it up and see how it looks. So I thought I'd use my Nimrod MR2 crew seat as the modeling backdrop for the finished product. So here it is. My first ever leather working project. And I made this wallet. All hand stitched, all hand cut, polished, finished off, and it does work. You can fit cards in front and back, put cash in the middle, and change. So I'm really proud of it. Have I made mistakes? Absolutely, but I've learned so much just from this first attempt. I know how to improve things for the future, but I'm really happy with the result. And I will definitely make another one uh, in the future. But I've got other projects in mind for this bit of leather, um, which will come at some point in the future, which I'll video for you and, and take you along for the ride. But yeah, um, really happy. And it just proves that YouTube is a really good uh, sourcing ground for doing research on how to do things. And for those of you who are you know, pondering whether to do these kind of crafts, I wholeheartedly encourage you to do it and if there are any leather workers of you out there watching this video I would really appreciate some constructive criticism about how I can improve but thank you for watching and I'll see you in the next video until then take care bye bye